it's really nice to be able to look into my bedroom and see how nicely that bed is made and that room's pretty well done except for a few things that need to be put away and organized for clothing but that will also be part of what needs to be done in the closet and then this is the rest of the things that are needing some work on and put away and organized yet over here still got a couple of boxes um that bag i'm going to use it was it had some stuff from walmart in it that was delivered yesterday and since it was on the front step or the porch step um they did protect it from the rain we had but there's been a lot of boxes that have been put away and things that didn't need to be in um in the house uh, some things did you get put back out there were a few things that i was able to give away yesterday um the young lady or woman who helped clean my house when i left the old house and wanting to make sure that it was really just right for the new owner um she came and she helped me to unpack and so she was so sweet to to do that she had a couple of hours yesterday morning and <clears throat> just super nice girl nice woman actually and so a lot of boxes did get emptied things got put away there was uh, a major appliance that was given away that I really don't use. I need to have something smaller for in here. There's a few boxes now underneath there. All of those things are um, not necessarily needed. And so much of that will be gone through once I have the major dishes put away. There's been some good organization that has happened. I'd really like to get this office done today. I'm not sure if I can in the two hours that I'm going to have to do it. But I've got some things in this storage area. I've got plenty of space for more canned goods. A little area up here for things like that I don't need all the time. But need access to. And... And down here is my crock pot and blender and can opener. And then this one has uh, my mix that I have for uh, my drink that goes with my beets. And so those are things for health. <clears throat> and the apple cider vinegar and MCT oil. This one has a couple of things in it. Currently, my glasses are missing, and that's where they're going to go. They're out in the shed, so that still needs to come out. And then here, I have dishes. Need plates. There's plates missing. There's a couple other things missing, but they're going to fit very well in there. And do have my silverware drawer there's utensils that will go here some missing forks and so on they're out in the shed and boxes that need to be brought in but it is nice that there's some progress made fluttered i can't wait till i get this cleaned up and organized and pretty soon i'm going to be talking about the heating in here on the cold nights and some of the incredible challenges that there has been and then in another video i'm going to discuss briefly uh another area that is a challenge things i hadn't thought about and so i want to make sure to share these so maybe somebody else can learn and be able to make adjustments and have a more smooth uh transition from going from a house to an RV or a small home. Thanks for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this and you will like and subscribe and 
get to see more uh, videos on this transition.